Hi and welcome to day three of my uh, Edinburgh Fringe. Um, Edinburgh was incredibly wet today. It was raining its arse off. And as the city is just on a massive hill, everything was wet, everything's running everywhere. Raindrops the size of golf balls. The castle was barely visible because of all the mist and cloud and stuff. It was actually really quite creepy at times. My first gig was Bennett Aaron, um, who I went to see at the Udderbelly. He's a Welsh comedian. Um, I was probably the second youngest person in his audience. Uh, I love his delivery. I love the Welsh accent. I got a ticket for him off the back of Board Game Smackdown the other day, and yeah, he was he was good. I mean, he's not hugely laugh out loud, but I enjoyed it. Uh, next thing I saw was all killer, no filler. Live. Uh, that's, so that's the podcast of the Serial Killer podcast with Kerry pritchard McLean and Rachel Fairburn, who I'm seeing tomorrow. Um, yeah, it was all about a woman who lived in New Orleans, and uh, then they did some, some of their other material that they just devolves into chatting. Uh, the next person I saw was uh, Laura Lex. She was good, um, but she was a bit bouncy for me. She was a bit too happy and upbeat. And although she was tackling some difficult issues and some mental health issues and stuff, she was really bouncy. So it was good to see that, but it's not necessarily my thing. Then it was David O'Doherty. Oh, my God. He came out. He's a consummate performer. He came out playing a song, uh, and he just kept the momentum going all the way through. He was absolutely amazing. Um, I love all of his little songs and stuff that he does like that. I love all these little stories about Ireland. Again, his delivery delivery in his accent are just amazing they make it for me um, then I went over to um, the Teviot Square um, so outside the Udderbelly this morning it was raining its ass off and no one was there and then even tonight even though it was a little bit misty that was totally decked out then I went to see Will Seward um, and his spooky midnight ghost stories if you can imagine a young Brian Blessed shouting mental shit at you at midnight then that is kind of what that is it was really funny um, sentient grandfather clocks venomous octopus cult all that stuff it was mad i really enjoyed it i had a great day uh, catch you guys tomorrow